Web is truly a civilization scale mission. It not only changes what we know, but how we think about ourselves. It will pick up uh, where the Hubble Space Telescope and Spitzer Space Telescopes left off in their capabilities. And it lets us see out through 13 billion years of cosmic time to look at the first generation of galaxies that formed after the Big Bang. It will also look at these worlds out there, exoplanets, that may or may not harbor life. And all these little dots are stars. All these little dots are galaxies, uh, some of which are bigger than our own. And now this red splotch that you see there, that galaxy, that's a galaxy, that galaxy is more than 33 billion light years away. Astronomers and space enthusiasts have always been fascinated with the universe due to its vastness and complexity. A new era of space research has begun with the launch of the James Webb Space Telescope, which holds the promise of solving some of the deepest mysteries of the universe. The Webb Telescope is focused on studying galaxy mergers as one of its many scientific goals. By doing so, it aims to shed light on the early cosmos and solve long-standing mysteries. Investigating the early universe is one of the main goals of the James Webb Space Telescope. And now Webb's in-camp instruments' unparalleled sensitivity and resolution have made it possible to see, for the first time, what is present in the local environments of galaxies in the very early universe. This has provided an explanation for one of astronomy's most puzzling mysteries. Why do scientists see light from hydrogen atoms when they should have been completely obscured by the pure gas that emerged following the Big Bang? Hello everyone, welcome back to Envision Space, where we dive into the fascinating world of space exploration. Today, we have an exciting topic to discuss. James Webb's groundbreaking discovery that is unraveling cosmic puzzles. Specifically, we'll explore how galaxy mergers are illuminating mysteries from the early universe. But before we delve into that, if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for more space-related content. In this video, we will also tell you how this discovery helped us shed light on the early universe and illuminate mysteries that have perplexed scientists for years. This is a rare and exciting opportunity to explore one of the most mysterious and ancient objects in the universe. So stay tuned and don't miss it. The James Webb Space Telescope, which launched in 2021, has seen a group of galaxies that belong to the mysterious Cosmic Dawn era, offering a breathtaking look into the early history of our universe. Using advanced computer simulations, scientists were able to simulate the evolution of the first galaxies. These show that in comparison to the massive galaxies like our Milky Way that now populate the cosmos, Star formation in these galaxies occurred differently in the first few hundred million years following the Big Bang event 13.8 billion years ago. These new web observations have found small faint objects surrounding the very galaxies that showed the inexplicable hydrogen emission. In conjunction with state-of-the-art simulations of galaxies in the early universe, the observations have shown that the chaotic merging of these neighboring galaxies is the source of this hydrogen emission. Since the speed of light is limited to 300,000 kilometers per second, the distance from a galaxy affects how long it takes for its light to reach our solar system. Because of this, studies of the farthest galaxies not only enable us to explore the farthest reaches of the universe, but also enable us to study the universe in the past. Astronomers need extremely powerful telescopes that can observe very far and thus very faint galaxies in order to understand the very early universe. One of Webb's key capabilities is its ability to observe those very distant galaxies and hence to probe the early history of the universe. An international team of astronomers has solved a long-standing astronomical mystery by making effective use of Webb's amazing instruments. 
Since the very first galaxies were places of intense and active star formation, they were abundant producers of Lyman alpha emission, a type of light that hydrogen atoms release into space. However, these regions of active star formation, also referred to as stellar nurseries, were surrounded by a massive volume of neutral hydrogen gas throughout the epoch of reionization. Moreover, there was a greater amount of this neutral gas in the interstellar medium than there is at present. Astronomers have long expected that the abundant Lyman alpha emission emitted in the very early universe should not be seen today because of the gas's incredible ability to absorb and scatter this type of hydrogen emission. However, the astronomers have already seen evidence of very early hydrogen emission, thus this theory has not always stood up to scrutiny. This has created a mystery. How is it that this hydrogen emission, which should have long since been absorbed or scattered, is being observed? One of the most puzzling problems with earlier studies was the discovery of hydrogen atom light in the early universe, which was supposed to be completely blocked by the pristine neutral gas that was created just after the Big Bang. Numerous theories have been put up in the past to provide an explanation for this inexplicable emission. Spectacularly, Webb's unique combination of angular resolution and sensitivity enabled the team to make an important breakthrough. The smaller, fainter galaxies that encircled the bright galaxies from which the inexplicable hydrogen emission had been identified may be resolved by the data made with Webb's in-cam instrument. In other words, the surroundings of these galaxies appear to be a much busier place than we previously thought, filled with small, faint galaxies. These smaller galaxies were interacting and merging with one another, and Webb has revealed that galaxy mergers play an important role in explaining the mystery emission from the earliest galaxies. Sergio Martin Alvarez, a team member from Stanford University, adds, where Hubble was seen only a large galaxy, Webb sees a cluster of smaller interacting galaxies. And this revelation has had a huge impact on our understanding of the unexpected hydrogen emission from some of the first galaxies. The team then used state-of-the-art computer simulations to explore the physical processes that might explain the results. They discovered that the rapid accumulation of stellar mass caused by galaxy mergers both accelerated strong hydrogen emission and made it easier for that radiation to escape along pathways free of a lot of neutral gas. So, the high merger rate of the previously unobserved smaller galaxies presented a compelling solution to the long-standing puzzle of the inexplicable early hydrogen emission. To deepen their understanding of the process underlying the ejection of hydrogen emission from these dynamic systems, the team plans to conduct follow-up observations with galaxies at different phases of merging. In the end, this will allow them to advance our knowledge of the evolution of galaxies. Equipped with state-of-the-art instruments such as the Near Infrared Spectrograph and the Mid Infrared Instrument, the Webb Telescope is capable of capturing detailed images and spectra of celestial objects in the infrared spectrum. This capability is crucial for studying galaxy mergers as it allows astronomers to peer through dust clouds that might obscure the view in other wavelengths. Images captured by the Webb Telescope showcase galaxies in various stages of merging providing a visual narrative of the dynamic and chaotic processes that characterize the early universe. These snapshots offer astronomers a unique opportunity to witness the formation of stars, track the distribution of matter, and understand the chemical composition of galaxies during this crucial period. The observations made by the Webb Telescope regarding galaxy mergers are already challenging existing theories about the early universe. Preliminary findings suggest that galaxy mergers were more frequent during this epoch than previously believed, raising questions about the role they played in shaping the cosmic landscape we observe today. These insights have profound implications for our understanding of galactic evolution and the cosmic processes that molded the universe into its current state. As the James Webb Space Telescope continues its mission, 
we can anticipate a wealth of new information about the early universe and the cosmic puzzles that have long eluded us. Galaxy mergers, illuminated by Webb's powerful instruments, are proven to be invaluable keys to unlocking the secrets of our cosmic origins. In the coming years, we can expect the Webb telescope to unveil more breathtaking images and provide deeper insights into the mysteries that have captivated humanity for centuries. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more interesting space-related content. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. This is Envision Space, signing off.